So we're back in the land of Skyrim to continue the Bard quest line back on. The guy we have to talk to, Yorn, is probably back at the Bard place. So we just gotta run back. So last time we watched that guy talk, speak out, act out the verse. Someone left the door open, so we gotta go in twice. Let the record show that going in twice is never a tough deal. It's not It's not a problem. It's never an issue. At any rate, what is this? Uh, that woman was being really bitchy. Hey, Yorn, what's up? Ah, the bard to be. Did Fiarmo send you? Everyone's got random ass names here. I'll tell everyone we're ready, but we'll start the festival at dusk. So let me guess, I gotta wait till dusk. Yep. Dark. We'll get the festival started when you do. Oh, that's great. What time is it? It is 7 a.m. All right, let's wait 12 hours. So we'll just continue this on and move on from that. The bard, I don't know, that going into the cave and getting the verse in itself was pretty cool, but other than that, it's just been, you know, listening to people talk about some douchebag king from way back when. At any rate, it is now night. Ah, the, I'll tell everyone come talk Okay, or not. Talk. Well, okay, you know, he said, he said dusk, you know. Dusk to me is like depending on when the sun sets. Is you know, in the summer it might be seven or eight. I don't know, I don't fucking know. Whatever. We'll just wait till ten PM. That's definitely nighttime. There there should be no issues we'll about get the festival started when you do. Yeah, yeah, it's it's night. Uh, great. Looks like you'll be one of us soon. We'll gather outside the college for the burning of King Olaf. That's great, see? Now people know that it's 10 o'clock and that it is indeed nighttime, so we can head back out. Won't have to go in twice this time, unfortunately. I do wonder what this festival is even going to be like. You know, is it going to be someone just chatting, or... Oh, they're going to burn a big dummy. They're going to burn this big old dummy. Why can't I burn the big dummy? I have fire breath. Like, look at this. See? See? That, that should be on fire. That is ridiculous. Where the hell is the guy at? I just gotta, like, wait here. I'm here. I guess we have to wait for everyone to freaking show up. Get Holy crap. Pies. Get your meat pies. I don't want a meat pie. Hey, buddy. Welcome, people of solitude. We of the Bard's College are pleased to be here to celebrate the burning of King Olaf. The festival would not have been possible without the dedication and hard work of our latest applicant. Slow clap initiate. With the lighting of the effigy... You know, I tried to light that thing. That thing is not flammable at all. He becomes a full-fledged member of the Bard's College. Or it's really flammable. Please welcome our newest Bard. Me. That's right. Even though it was wow, look at them slow clap, man. They are not they are not interested in me becoming a bard at all. They, they all stopped at the same time too. They like you. I don't. Do you see that clap, man? That clap sucked. Yes, congratulations. You are now a full fledged member of the Bard's College. Due to your adventurous nature, several of the college professors have some things they wish you to do. What's more, Elisif has declared the burning of King Olaf should become a weekly event. Weekly? And finally, there's the matter of the patronage that Elisif wanted me to give you. A weekly event? Well, I got 1,500 gold. That's cool. So now apparently people in the, in the Bard's College thing... This, okay, this is it. Anyway. Apparently they've got some work for me in here, possibly. So I'm going to wait until, like, you know, morning when people are up and about doing the regular thing I imagine that this might be like the companions one where it's like go do this overly generic quest that you've been doing for the longest time and I really don't feel like doing those on repeat all day so now that it's 11 o'clock and I would assume people would be out and about or not apparently I wonder if they're still at that stupid thing like they never got back Cause I don't see a damn person in here. Oh, oh, yep, there they all are. You guys, let me talk to you. Welcome to Solitude, home nope. of the arts. Not much. How about you? You're new here, right? You don't say shit. Welcome to the bars. You don't say anything. Yorn. Okay. Didn't you say that people had like you know stuff for me to do? Like they had some, they had some work. It's probably just useless BS. So you know, chances are we've just mopped everything of any importance up. So from then, I'll just move on. 
which means we have all this stuff. Nestled in here are like the one slash two quests that are actually on the uh, on the main one, which the one I just chose I'm pretty sure is not. At this point, it's just about pretty much methodically. Oh, who is this guy? He's running towards me. The hell? Bloody enough for you, outsider. The hell was he running? Markarth, is it bloody enough for you? No, it's not. Are you threatening me? If I was threatening you, me believe me, you word. know it. I'd smash this dude in you the ground. You outsiders never learn. If the four sworn don't get you, the guards will throw you in Sidna mine to work your fingers off. Nah, I'll be good. You think that's water in the river? Blood and silver are what flows through Markar and friend. What a cool guy. It's right there in the name of the most powerful family in Markarth, the Silverbloods. They have a whole mine filled with prisoners to dig up silver ore, get smelted by workers they pay, and they own half the city. I work for them. The inn is named after them. When the guards make an arrest, they check with them first. Jarl is who you want to talk to. Always coined to be made killing off some forsworn in the hills. As long as you don't mind going axe to axe with a bunch of Daedra worshipping savages who practice the dark arts. I've been killing them all game long. Yeah. Alright. So where in Carmen San Diego exactly is this uh this quest? I guess it I guess it's right here. I don't even know what we have to do, but to the shrine we go. Ah, just have to talk to somebody? Apparently. Hey you, what's up? I'm sorry to drag you into Mark Hearth's problems. But after that attack in the market, I'm running out of time. That's cool. You're an outsider. You're dangerous looking. You'll do. I am pretty badass looking, aren't I? You want answers? Well, so do I. So does everyone in the city. A man goes crazy in the market. Everyone knows he's a forsworn agent. Guards do nothing. Nothing but clean up the mess. Didn't they kill the guy too? This has been going on for years. And all I've been able to find is murder and blood. I need help. Please, you find out why that woman was attacked, who's behind Waylon and the Forsworn, and I'll pay you for any information you bring me. Okay. Find evidence about blah blah blah. Find evidence. What is this? Can activate the shrine. So this guy who's been apparently looking for stuff for a while can't find anything, and now it's up to us to do it for him. In return for gold, I hope. And... Don't even tell... Okay. Apparently he just wants me to go, like, right over here to the Femurs of Steel. There we go. Uh, I really... No, that's not even where we're supposed to go, is it? It most certainly was not. So, I guess I just have to go a little bit further this away. Aw, oh, damn it, it's gonna be up there. Well, fuck. This is kind of what happened with the, uh... The whatchamacallit, that... The quest that got me in with the Dark Brotherhood. I don't even think I've explored this whole place yet, and now I'm just kind of running around willy-nilly, wherever the hell I feel like. Uh, no, I can, I can make this. Yeah, see, there's ledge here, and then that. Alright, you want me to go right in here? Alright, this is, this is where I was, where I was at before, and it told me to, like, leave. I'm gonna be a silversmith. Okay, never mind, let me go back in here and see what's going on. I guess I was in the right place. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. What if it's the Silver Bloods? Ah, yes. Rented the nicest room we had for a whole month. Best we all forget about her. Bad luck to talk about the dead in Markarth. Huh. Obtain the key to Margaret's room. Can I. Wow. Okay. Why can't I just get like? Sure thing. It's yours for a. I'll what? show you. Where's the Where's the room? Right this way. Anyway. Remember, ale is cheaper than blood in Markarth. Can I Can I go in here? I need the. Well, I can unlock it. Apparently, this is the room. Let me know if there's any. I bet he has it. Yep, he does have it. All right. You know what? F you, man. I am making a save here. I'll make a new save real quick. Pocket, give me that key. I got busted. Guess I need to reload. <laughs> that didn't go so well. Can always try it again. I can always wait until like he turns around and leaves and then do it. All right, let's let's try this again here. Damn it! Now they're gonna see me. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about what. If I can't get you some. 
Are you joking? You just rented a room. Well, it didn't let me pock pickpocket. Up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Give me that. Ha ha. Ah, got it. All right, fine. Fuck you. I'm closing this door. F you, man. All right, I got the key. I don't want to steal anything. Why is it telling me to come back in here? Well, this is the room.